Credit unions offer the same consumer financial services that you can find at a bank. Checking accounts, savings accounts, CDs, auto loans, home loans, debit cards, credit cards, and more. So, you can find the same kind of accounts and loans at a credit union as you can at a bank. But credit unions are different from banks, and we're going to explain how. Reason number one, credit union members elect their board of directors. Credit unions are member-owned. When you join Members Credit Union and open up an account, you're not just a customer, you're an equal owner. Each member votes in the democratic election of the credit union's board of directors. It doesn't matter how much money a member has, each member has one equal vote. That means you have a say in credit union decisions that affect you and your credit union accounts. At a bank, you are a customer, not an owner. The bank is owned by a group of investors who may not even be customers of the bank at all. These investors decide who is on the board of directors and therefore heavily influence big decisions that affect you and the money you work hard for to save in the bank. Reason number two, credit union members share a common bond. Credit unions serve groups of people who share a common bond because they work together or live in the same community. Traditionally, each credit union began with a few hardworking employees or socially concerned citizens who were unsatisfied with the service provided by their local bank. So, they started their own credit union to give their fellow employees and neighbors a place to borrow and save money in a fair and cooperative environment, not influenced by rich bank investors. The popularity of credit unions has grown quite a bit since their humble beginnings, and now almost everyone in the world can find a credit union where they work or where they live to join. Banks are founded by rich investors who already have a lot of money. They start a bank with hopes of making a profit. These investors most likely are not interested in bonding with their customers. Reason number three, credit unions are member focused. Since our members own us, we focus on their needs. When the credit union earns money, we pay it back to our members with free benefits, fewer fees, better loan rates, and higher dividends to your checking account and savings accounts. Banks have to answer to their investors, who are focused on making more money. That's why you'll find that banks charge more fees and pay less back to their customers. Reason number four, credit unions are socially responsible. Members Credit Union understands what it means to be a good community citizen. Not only do we provide scholarships to members pursuing an education, we are also community involvement fanatics. Our employees have raised thousands of dollars, walked hundreds of miles, and volunteered many hours to support community causes like research for curing diabetes, providing support services for cancer patients, collecting toys and food for underprivileged families, supporting active military and veterans, and collecting school supplies for local schools. And you know what? There are socially responsible people who work at our local banks too. Bank employees are part of our community. They are caring citizens, and some of them are even proud credit union members. Maybe one day those rich investors who own the banks will take a cue from their socially responsible employees. But until that happens, you can always join a credit union.